Hey, Cafe Lot uh, robot people. Uh, John Houck here. And uh, like you, I love my robot. And uh, um, one of the things that I've noticed a lot of people are talking about online are the, is the fact that the arms don't stay up when you're uh, putting the uh, portafilter uh, with hot water uh, underneath. And uh, so I've noticed um, many of you use a rubber band method where you wrap it around. Um, many of you just say it's not a problem. Just hold one arm up and, and put the portafilter in, and what's the big deal? Um, well, there's also, recently I saw some uh, 3D printed uh, blocks that you can mount on here. I think you need to move the pressure gauge or something. And those will connect together with a magnet. Um, so that's pretty cool. What I did uh, was because I too have a 3D printer. Yep, I'm sorry, I'm one of those. Um, <clears throat> I printed another one of these spacers because I didn't see them um, for sale at uh, the Cafe Lot store. Maybe I missed them. Uh, so I printed one of these that's half millimeter thick, uh, put that in here, and guess what? The arms are a lot stiffer and they kind of stay up. But they don't really stay up, but they, they are a lot, a lot more uh, resistant to falling, so that's kind of nice. Um, but I also noticed then when I did that that they seem to not wobble around much at all. So um, I 3D printed another piece, um, and this one I'm just calling a, a shoulder patch or a shoulder thing. Um, yes, it's ugly. I'm not making uh, excuses for that. Uh, but uh, it goes on the arm, it just snaps in place, you just put it on like that. And if you look on the back side, it's just kind of like a C shape that snaps around the shape of the arm. And it has this, uh, this weird little button that sticks out and you can push it and it kind of springs and pushes in. Uh, this is printed with PLA and uh, go up and it holds it. Pretty exciting, huh? Um, and you can see what it looks like from the back side and uh, how that holds it up. And so it's just a single piece of it. So really, uh, in order for this to work, you do need something to stabilize this. Uh, you could probably put a washer in here and squeeze the uh, casting together to get you a little more stability. Um, I went with a, a washer and just didn't uh, squeeze the casting. And... Uh, washer. Maybe if I would have gone with uh, two washers or a thicker washer, the whole thing would have stayed up by itself. Um, in any case, so you could uh, uh, try that. Um, so I th just thought I'd share that with you and uh, hope you enjoy it. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.